Hey guys, it is Ju Chantel. Welcome back to my channel. Tonight we're having vegan chicken tender tacos and fries. So I just have lettuce, um, avocado, because I ran out of cheese in the store, ran out as well. They didn't have any um, besides chicken tender. And then I have some fries on the side. My vegan ranch, of course, and Dr. Pepper. Let me get a thunder and we can get started. All right, let's get our first bite. Mm. How are you guys doing? What are you having tonight? I couldn't decide. Um, I kind of want a panda. Kind of want some chow mein with some um, egg rolls. I really didn't feel like driving. Over there, after work. So, I was like, we just want have cheese today. I'll have to go to another store tomorrow or maybe by tomorrow they'll have it restocked because I went twice this week and didn't have it restocked. My lettuce, avocado's falling out. Y'all, last night at work, everything was going fine. And so, of course, those late night customers, I want to come to the last minute or late with all the issues. It was like a, with the mother and son. And I saw him just walking around backward, back and forth. And I'm looking at the time, I'm like, it's getting late. When are they gonna cash out? So he finally comes and then the mom's like, this is a separate transaction. So I ring his stuff up and he started asking me about something else. So I'm like, okay, well, if you wanna sign up for that, you gotta, Sign up on your phone. So, in the meantime, his mom's like, well, I'm going to buy my stuff. I'm like, all right. I already run his stuff through. So, I'm like, all right. Um, on to the next order. So, I'm like, okay, on to the next order. So, you could... um. You could bring a new customer in a new transaction. You just put the other one on hold pretty much. Just click a button. Anyways. So I make her stuff up. There's a price issue. So she goes back to see the price. Sorry. That one got crispy. <laughs> um, I put these on the, I made these on the stove, obviously. <laughs> um, so she takes forever to come back and now it's literally like seven, eight minutes to closing. I see him, I'm like, is he gonna come cash out or what? So now I've got two orders that I'm waiting for. Another customer comes up. I start ringing them up, and then I realize I ring up their stuff. 
I ring up the lady stuff on their stuff. So I just call the manager. I'm like, let me just delete this whole transaction note again. She's like, okay. She goes, yeah, yeah, that total seems better. That total seems better. So the lady had like, I think I rang like five items of hers up, or I can't remember how many items I rang. So she comes back and I'm like, this does not, like, I still don't know if this is on sale because whatever possible we have to do things. So then now I call, she's like, it's not on sale. She's so loud. Her guys, she is just allowed. Her voice just carries loud. And before that happened, <clears throat> she's asking her son how much something is. How much is it? How much is it? And then she turns to me, how much? And she's just like, screw. I'm like, oh my God. So I'm like calmly telling her price. I'm like everyone's like looking like, what the heck? And so then um, the manager was like, okay, yeah, give it to her for this price. So in the meantime, there's other things she didn't want. So I put him back in my little go back. As soon as the person comes to take it back, she wants it now. Mind you, the items that she didn't want to take originally, they were, they were, so she did it twice. The items that she wanted, the items that she saw on sale, it was like three of them. So she's like, well, I don't want it now. And then she comes back and she's like, well, no, I want it. This and that. So I'm like, back and forth, back and forth. But I mean, literally as a girl comes to take it back. Oh, I want it. It's a good price. You just told me a few minutes ago, you didn't want it. I'm like, oh my God. Oh my goodness. So... Now, she's like, I'm going to pay for my son's stuff. I'm like, no wonder why he can pay for it. He's waiting for her. So she pays cash for his stuff. And then his stuff was like over $200. It was like random stuff. And then her stuff was like a hundred some dollars. And then I was clear to go. And that was the last, my last customer. Over my, of the night. Even so when we got back, like we were closing, even my co was he was like, dang, what was her problem? Well, she's just, she's just loud. So <clears throat> I was going to make three, but I was like, nah, two's good. Plus, you know, I got to have one for dessert. Um, I found the um, non-dairy Magnum um, ice cream bars I get. And usually they come in a pack of three and um, they have the mini ones, but they also have the mini ones and, you know, just the regular. And so I was at Target yesterday and they had the non-dairy in the mini. So I was like, ah, so I got a pack of those. So I'm like, oh wait, I have a lot now. So I, I, I oh my God, the regular size, I thought I had one left, but I actually have two left. And then the minis, you get six. I was like, I'm set, I'm set. Because sometimes I do like to have like dessert before work, but I don't want to bring like a whole big old bar. You know what I mean? Something small and quick, but like ice cream. So that's perfect. And you get six of them. So that'll last me. A little bit because I don't eat those. It's funny. I don't eat the ice cream bars as fast as I do if I was just to go to Cold Stone and get ice cream. The plant-based ice cream. I don't know why. But anyways, you guys, that's my ramble. All right, you guys. Um, I hope you guys have a great morning, noon, night, weekend, all the above. Uh, depending on when you see this video. As always, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe to my TikTok and Instagram. We'll see you in the next one. Take care, guys. Bye.